Well, we're here at Sunstone Knoll. Yeah. So this time I brought a shovel and my makeshift thing that does stuff. There's a word for it. I see something shiny down there. But what I'm doing is I'm digging through these piles here because every time I try to pick it up on this stuff, they fall through to the bottom. So I figured to myself, why not just sift it? Look, there's one right there already. Okay. So I'll sift it through. Let's see what's in there. Fill in some of these holes with the big rocks. There's one right there. They're not very big, but that's fine. I want to put them in little tiny bottles and make them into necklaces, so it's all right if they're tiny. So I'm going to keep sifting here for a bit, and if I find anything larger than these guys, ooh, that one's not too bad. Not too bad. I'll keep you posted. We have a lot of ventures planned for today. I even brought my puppers along. They're hanging out with Dad. So yeah, it's going to be a good, fun day. Oh, I dropped it. I just found one that's still in its host rock. Look at that. Sweet. That's pretty cool. Hi, Lola. Say, that's pretty cool. All right, we're, look right there. My wonderful husband person has taken over sifting. He's gonna hang out with the dogs in some shade. I am going to walk around and look for some on the ground. I just found this one when I was helping him get his buckets. Look at that guy. He is very smoothed out and very nice. So, we're going to try to find some more like that. The trick is, is to look for the shine in the sunlight. And I have no idea where this camera is pointed to. So, <laughs> forgive me if you can't see anything at all. I am sorry. Oh, I want to avoid hiking up that hill if I can. I've already been up it a couple times. So we're going to go around the bottom 
because I figure everything from up there must come down here eventually. So we'll just walk around and look for glints in the sunlight. Although maybe I should go the other way around towards the sunlight. There's one. That might be a little bit doable because look at all these ones jumping out at me. Oh, nice. And there's another one right there. And right there. And a little one right there. Alright, so that's a piece of dirt. So I lost one in the picking up of them. Like I said, I'm hoping to make some cute little bottle necklaces out of these, so I would like to find quite a few today. I think my husband's going to find quite a few in those buckets. I hear my puppy making an escape. Come on, baby girl. Come on. Come to mama. You going to come help me find shinies? Ah, that's a spider web. Well, come here. Where are you going? Hey, hey. Thank you. Look at, she filled it up with the rocks. Whoa. I wouldn't want to fall in there. Yikes. Yeah, don't go in there. I wonder how deep it is. I always have to tell myself at times like these, curiosity killed the cat. But I still would like to know. Maybe if I throw a rock in there. Ah, it's not too deep. All right, let's go find some rocks, Lola. You've got rocks. Oh. Hey. Hey. Come on. This way. Oh, I see a good shine over here. Don't lose sight of it. Keep it in your eyesight. Because as soon as you get up on it, they vanish. Wow. There's one. And there's one. Hey. Lola. And there's one. I still don't see the one that brought me up here. I lost that one. I got distracted. There's a whole lot of them right in this area. There's one. I just can't find the one that looked very large from way back there. Could have been just there of the light. There's a sign, Loba, and the box. Monkey witness post, please do not disturb nearby survey marker. Oh, 
okay. But why is there a monkey? He's knocked down. I should at least stand him up. There you go. There you go. Look, there's a survey marker right there. What does it say? Hey! What are you doing? All right. U.S. Coast and Genetic Geo Geodic. 1970. Cool. cool. All right, you coming? Right there, right there. Look how pretty. I would, I need to attach her to my belt again. I'm not quite sure why I unattached her from my belt. Look, I see another shiny Lola. Super flat one. Hi, Red Ant. I want that. Don't bite me. Don't bite me. That's a big one right there. Huh. Interesting. Whoa. I wonder what kind of rock that is. I like that, whatever that is. All right, you gonna jump? Sorry. Hi, close up with Lola. Hi. Yeah, is that rough terrain? Is that some rough terrain? Okay, let's not tell anybody about that. Oh, but that hurt something in my back, baby girl. Ooh, there's a big shiny. Can I get to it without dying? Look how pink those flowers are. Ah, I looked away. <gasps> Gravity hates my life. Thank goodness there was a rock here to keep me from falling in all those stickers though. <sighs> all right. It's right there between those two big rocks. My butt. Here we in between those two big rocks. Right in between those two big rocks. And nothing. Wait, there it is. I found it. Oh. Well, it's still in the rock. 
How cool. Well, that was worth a fall in my bum, wasn't it? too dangerous for myself. For reals though, I think this is the end of this adventure. It's time to go play with some obsidian. I think I found quite a few very pretty bobbles for my stuff and the worst comes to worst, I can... Oh, wow. I just caught that out the corner of my eye. Holy cow. Did somebody just put this here? They're just... Holy moly. I don't know if I should take it or leave it. I thought they were all in the rock. Look at all those. Oh. whoever left that so very much that was pretty cool